And we're going to start our uh, tour, our birthday tour here in the kitchen. And yet again, Trudy is making marmalade. Yes, tied to the sink yet again is Isabel. It's lemon marmalade. And just, just look what we've got. These come from Moans and Benta, our friends up on the hill where you visited, the ones with the kangaroos. birthday Isabel I'm so sorry I'm not going to make it um, I know you're going to have a wonderful day and a wonderful celebration with all the family um, much love to you and uh, as I say so sorry I can't be there bye in keeping with the impromptu nature of this entire project here's Pam you might remember <laughs> Pam that's Pam next door up the hill we envy them because they're up the hill anyway she'd just like to say something have a wonderful wonderful birthday I wish I was there. I think it would be very exciting. Yes, but no Shiraz, only the Cabernet Sauvignon as we oh, know. Oh, I'd, I'd be drinking anything. <laughs> I think if, I, if I turned 100, I think I'd, I'd be drinking anything. Made it down to Terry's shed unscathed, and that is no mean feat, I can tell you. And here's Terry. This is Terry next door here, remember? So you might have something to say. Hi, Isabella. Happy birthday. Not everyone reaches your grand old age. I think it's fantastic. And you'll keep on going, I know, because you've got that spirit. <laughs> Here we've got Valu and Marque who Hi. live with us and I, I think uh, you've seen them before on the video. Anyway, Valu can now say Happy Birthday Isabella. Can you do it again? Say Happy Birthday Bella. Isabella. Oh, that's lovely. A happy Birthday Bella. I think that's even more beautiful. Isabella. Anyway, there's, there's Marque, Marque and Valu. They're off to the library. Yeah. Happy Birthday. <laughs> Now we're going to take you down the road to the community garden where we spend a lot of time. These are our broad beans and here are some of our new beds and the team are going to say something. Uh, here we are mum and this is the, the tea and drinking area where most of the politics and all the food is eaten and uh, this is some of the team, the, the uh, Walnuts Bay community garden Hi, team. Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Isabella. Happy birthday to you. Hooray! Hooray! Thank you so much. Now having checked out some of the local wildlife, have a look at some of our wildlife. This is Z Zoe, Will and Mum and Dad, that's Herb and Jesse. See what they're up to. Here I am all rugged up and you might wonder why. Well, okay, here we are actually in the Newcastle skating rink and Zoe's doing skating. Not far away, a new tourist attraction has opened up where kids can go and pat giant stingrays. And we took Will and Zoe there, and Will got incredibly excited, declaring he was in love with giant stingrays. Kids love to go down to the bottom of the garden. We light a fire, we cook up little sausages, little frankfurters, and sometimes we do marshmallows, and we have a lunch down there, and the kids get completely covered in soot and ash, and love it. Mm -hmm. 
both Will and Zoe are great Lego fanatics, and for Will's birthday recently, all he wanted was more Lego. He's now six, and Zoe is now ten. And when they're visiting, they just love to go down to my little laboratory and play with the prototypes of the different toys. This is the uh, Rainbow Volcano released, I think it was, yes, earlier this year. Do your picture poses, Will. And along the theme of rainbows, uh, of course, maybe, Mum, you'd remember the rainbow lorikeets making that terrible noise on the deck? Well, this is what happens when they get together with Will in a very excited state. Great Grandma, have a happy birthday. Yes? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Great Grandma. This is a photo of Sam and Sarah in amongst their fuzzins, which are friend cousins. They're all children of friends of ours who had no relatives in Australia. So they kind of made their own families and they all go camping together still. And here's Sam and Sarah at a recent wedding and Sam is being Sam as usual. Hey Nan, it's Sam. Just wishing you an incredibly happy 100th birthday from my weird little art shed here in Australia. I'm absolutely amazed. I love your millions and I really hope I look as good as you do at 100. Love ya. wanted to wish you a very, very, very happy 100th birthday. Congratulations on hitting those triple digits. Um, I'm just on my rooftop at the moment. It's a glorious day. I'll give you a little round. So this is the lovely view of the harbour and then on the other side we've got Nobby's Beach. Over there, it's so clear today you can actually see Stockton Beach. Anyway, I hope you have a lovely birthday, lots of food, a bit of wine, and I'll see you next time I'm in the UK. Almost at the end of the Ellie Barn, a part of the slideshow, and with this sign from Zoe and Will, I think now is the time for a happy birthday song from Luigi, who, as you know, loves to sing to the harmonica. Well, that was Luigi doing his ear-shattering version of Happy Birthday to You Mum. Happy Birthday again. And now we've got a slideshow dating from about 80 years ago up until March this year. Jumping about. Uh, there's no commentary, but maybe uh, if people would like to stop the slideshow for you, there are captions and they can describe the photos to you. Happy Birthday Mum, to be continued. <laughs> 